All right, guys, welcome back to another video here on my channel. I have another unboxing for you guys today, and um, I opened the box already. I didn't see I hadn't pressed the record button, but we're going to go ahead and get started. Like I said, I opened this already. This will be a two model unboxing. We're going to take the peanuts out, put this to the side because it's trash. These. One of these I will need for the model airport, which is the Viva Air A320 Neo in the yellow livery. This this uh, plane comes to Mexico City Airport, which I will need. And the registration of this is HK5360. It's a Phoenix model, 1 to 400. Uh, the previous video I opened three uh, Phoenix models, and this is the fourth one. So these were bought separate. This is from a retailer actually. And these were shipped to me. But yeah. well let's actually let's go ahead and open this and then we'll open the other model. Alright, so I got this model because it like I said it comes to Mexico City and I need it because I want my airport to be as realistic as possible. I know I'm missing some planes and some models, and it's fine, I'll get to it, like I have mentioned in previous videos. But here's the livery. It's all yellow. It's light. It's a lighter yellow than Spirit, but it reminds me of it. And an antenna just fell off. Would you look at that? You guys saw it right here these model companies but nothing that's i'm not gonna make a big deal of it it's fixable and you know no big deal as long as the model's fine nothing the paint's not chipped or anything like that i'm fine even if a wing comes loose i'll just glue it back as long as the paint's not damaged but anyway back to the livery this is a colombian airline and I really can't see what these titles say at the very front. They're really small. But um, yeah, at the engines, we have the Viva Air titles. We also have them right here on the wings. We have the registration right here. I really like this. It looks to be the, the, the shape of the V for Viva. And it's a very, it's actually a very nice livery. Like I said, it reminds me of Spirit Airlines, except Spirit Airlines is like a darker yellow. And this is like a lighter but bright yellow. I like the, the mask on it. it. Reminds me a lot of the Air Canada livery, the new one. But um, yeah. the engines do look a little big, just like the Gemini Jets Neo engines. But I guess through all these years, we've, we've gotten used to it. We also have the registration down here. And um, yep, we will use this for our model airport. The next model we're unboxing is an NG model. It's the Airbus A321 American Airlines flagship Valor. I saw this, this plane, sorry, I was about to say model. I saw this plane at O'Hare in February when I was traveling. I was flying out of Terminal 3 when I flew American 787 down to Dallas. That video is on my YouTube in case you guys want to take a look at it in my trip report. And um, I love how NG does this nice, you know, work of art on their boxes. And this livery was painted, if, I, if I'm not wrong, I believe it was painted around January, February of this year. So, Registration on this is N167AN. We're gonna go ahead and open it. This should come with the NG points card, which it does. We're gonna pop the model out. We're gonna be careful with it, and then we'll take a look at it. And we're gonna put the cradle to the side because we don't need it. Now, just as a reminder, when you buy NG models, 
you get this card with every model and you scratch it you put the code on their website and you can redeem for free models or other stuff but i'm gonna use it for free models now this model right here the a321 has the nice american titles it's a nice uh you know i think ng does a better color shade of american airlines than gemini jets but that's my personal opinion everybody can think their own so right at right behind the american titles we have three medals which i don't know what they stand for then we have medal of honor some troops right here which is very nice actually i'm happy that american did this livery to honor all our military and all those people who served then on the tail we have our american uh, tail right here and um I like that NG does not put NG on the bottom like Gemini Jets does. And we have the registration with the American flag N1678N. This is a beautiful plane in real life. And if you ever get to see it, it's amazing. We have our Wi-Fi box right here. A couple antennas. And a couple on the bottom. Our landing gear. Front gear. Bottom, uh, back gear and the wings. The engines look pretty good. The detail, NG model. See, I don't mind spending a couple bucks more on NG models rather than Gemini jets because they do such a good job. And um, we're gonna put this down. And I have one more thing to unbox. It's not a model, but. I bought some trees for my airport. Not sure if it'll go look good or bad, but um, I got this at a local store. And um, I, I thought I would put them here by the grass areas. Maybe give it a different look. You know, try something new. If I if it doesn't look realistic or if I don't like how it looks, I'm gonna put it, take it out. But hopefully it looks good. And I can use it in my future model reports. I'm sorry, I keep saying model reports, airport updates. And like, you know, since this is my first time with the airport, I'm not used to. That's why I keep saying model, model updates. All right. So this comes in a set of two, four, six, eight trees. And like I say, we're gonna pop them out. Show you guys. So we'll put a couple down and then you guys can see what it will look like. I don't know, I actually kind of like it. And if we end up liking it, we're probably gonna leave them up, not remove them. So far, I think I'm liking it. I think we're gonna end up leaving these down. If I end up liking it, I will need like two more of these packets of trees. But for now, I think I, I think I, I like it. I think I look I like how it looks and we're gonna leave it for a couple of days. And if it looks good, we're gonna keep using it and have them for model updates i mean airport updates there i go doing that again but anyway yeah so stay tuned i will have more and um more more videos coming up more unboxings travel reports trip reports and hopefully anytime soon here maybe next week i'll do a first airport update on these realistic routes that come into Mexico City. But that's about it, guys. Thanks for watching, and I hope you have a good rest of your day. Wherever you are, consider subscribing. Sh share this video if you liked it, and um, subscribe, like I said, so you can keep getting my content if you liked it. I would, I'm going to be doing everything aviation-related. 
So thanks for watching and may God bless all of you.